With this example, we can demonstrate how the tablet can sense position as well as degree of touch. We've hooked it up to a sound, and so we've got a high, pure sound here, pitch going down as I descend, and richness with X, and degree controlling volume. And I can finger paint. Often, when we want to use the tablet surface to emulate a number of different virtual devices, it's useful to use a physical template laid over top of the tablet. Here I have five virtual potentiometers defined by their uh, cutouts as well as a number of buttons. By attaching it to the tablet surface, I now have an operating console for a particular simulation. In this case, it's a small sound synthesizer which I can turn on an oscillator. I can now adjust its volume and adjust its pitch and its spectral richness. As you can see, the three different controls affect three completely different parameters. I can add a second oscillator, raise its volume, change its richness, bring the pitch down, and even add a third oscillator. And I can shut them all off. What we have is an operating console done on a single physical device, which is reconfigurable depending on what template I have. And it saves going through all of the mechanical efforts to construct the analogous or the equivalent device, such as this one here, where I have likewise some single dimensional sliders and some button devices.